beauty right here. This is the diamond hand. Such a beauty. So I'm here in Miami with my guy T. So he's about to give me a nice little touch up and clean up. You see, you got me together. Ooh, your boy is soft. <laughs> Thank you again, man. Okay, well. I just want to get this facial done, that I said. Face feel pretty good, too, man. Look how clean this look, guys. by whatever you want you know like everything's tracked on the many levels it's tracked by the the value of the item the address it went to and the i guess the owner of the address right thing i'm expecting i'm expecting a lot of anti nft culture in here people are encroaching on their space the walls are shake you can see people pushing physical art a lot they believe in authenticity these are the real artists that are in museums decades. Materials used, obviously something hand painted is going to be a hell of a lot more valuable than something printed. Bigger pieces, the more valuable it's going to be too. Also, it's more difficult to transport, which adds value. If I huh. have moved the piece around to six galleries and spent ten grand, and I want to sell that piece, I got to get that money back out, right? <laughs> pieces out of this place just today. Wow. We're already at 50. Whoa. This is a bad new one. Look at this art.
first of all, I want to thank uh, my man Mo here. Come on, Mo. Are you leaving? Oh, you're not. You're yeah, I'm going to head out, Kevin. Uh, but yeah. It's a pleasure and an honor. Yes, yes, man. I want to thank you for, for actually introducing me to the NFTs, introducing me to the art, and opening my mind to, like, man, it's a whole other world. And I had a great time here at the Art Basel uh, 2021 here in Miami. And my guy here, he is a genius when it comes to this stuff, man. And uh, so I'm honored, much, I'm honored to Welcome to the community, here. and uh, we'll be here for years to come. Let's go.